Almighty God, our Father in heaven, this is my personal Kaddish. Inspired by the noble prayer of antiquity and written for the monumental symphony composed by Leonard Bernstein, a beloved friend and a kindred soul who wanted my living testimony, drawn from the depth of human suffering, to resonate in your kingdom with his celestial music. Mine is a layman Scottish father, contemporary, universal, and dedicated to your tormented children, Jews, Christians, Muslims, Hindus, and all others, believers and non-believers, yearning for peace, freedom, and justice in our chaotic, fratricidal, and suicidal world. I utter this lament with grief and anger, welling up from my own tragic past and the deluge of hatred, violence, and fear that is engulfing us again. Everywhere, hereditary enemies, mired in bigotry, terror, and despair, are at each other's throats. Even in your holy land, where all worship the same God and implore you to turn their swords into plowshares, I weep for them all, the dead and the living. My first tears are for my ravaged family perpetual victims of religious and ethnic persecution that reached its historic climax in my childhood, destroying everyone and everything around me, while you, supreme ruler of the universe, stood idly by. Equally indifferent were you, when I agonized in Auschwitz, Majdanek, and Dachau, where Eichmann's and Mengele's gruesome reality eclipsed Dante's vision of inferno. This day I am haunted by guilt for having survived when so many of mine were murdered. Now I must atone for the ritual mourner's Kaddish I could never recite because I had no dates of their demise. No closure, no Shiva, no graves for a stone, a flower, a prayer a prayer for their redemption. Iskadal v'iskadash shmei Rabba. Magnified. And sanctified. Be his great name. Amen.
Amen. Descend on us all. Amen.